Did you ever wonder where all your trash goes? Or did you ever wonder if your recyclables are really getting recycled? How about that old water tank? What happened to that? Lake County residents dispose of 1.6 million pounds of garbage every weekday. How would you like to have to figure out what to do with all of that? The Lake County Solid Waste District has the job of overseeing waste disposal and recycling in our county. The county maintains a huge 250-acre solid waste landfill in Painesville Township that is designed to be environmentally sound now and well into the future. Several recycling programs are in place to meet the needs of many of the county's 23 communities. Trucks roll into the landfill daily. They line up to be weighed and then move on to dump their trash. An unbelievable 800 tons of garbage arrive here every day. But the trash can't simply be dumped. It has to be contained. The landfill is divided into cells, some of which have been lined with an impervious rubber membrane. Under EPA mandate, 45 acres of this massive facility have been fully lined and many more will be in the future. It takes a whole cubic yard just to dispose of 1,300 pounds of trash. That means that each day, about 1,230 cubic yards of the facility get filled. Think about that. It's a cube of garbage that measures about the size of a two-story house. That's how much space the compacted trash from just one day takes up. This 15-acre cell, which was lined in the mid-90s, is now filled and closed. From bottom to top, it is 700 feet high. This cell must still be maintained daily because it's giving off methane gas, which must be piped away and stored for use. Leaks in the liner, which would be collected by a leaching system buried deep under the cell, are also a constant concern. Appliances like old stoves and water heaters and everything else that is constructed of metal is sorted out of the flow of garbage at the landfill. Metals are sent on for recycling and not buried. As you can see, your trash doesn't just get squished up and turned under. It's a costly process that takes up many man and machine hours and a vast chunk of land. This new 15-acre cell has been fully lined with an EPA-approved membrane. Workers lined the cell with large sheets of the material and then carefully welded the sections together. Every weld has been tested to ensure that the liner is leak-proof. A leaching system was then installed and completely covered with a thick layer of coarse, sand-like gravel. Workers then covered the sides of the cell with a layer of hay over one foot thick to protect the liner. This cell will serve the county's needs for a projected 15 to 20 years. Recycling helps take some of the burden off of the landfill. When you recycle, you're helping by reducing the amount of waste that could fill the cells and also by keeping hazardous and non-biodegradable materials out of the system. Of course, the reclaimed material becomes a huge benefit too. Each year, the Solid Waste District holds household hazardous waste collections. Held at the county fairgrounds, they are a great opportunity to dispose of everything from paint cans to motor oil. Several private companies participate to collect and recycle the waste we need to keep out of our landfill. The community recycling programs also help immensely. In 2006, 221,616 tons of materials were collected through the efforts of individual community, commercial, and industrial recycling programs. The county works with the 23 individual communities and many businesses and industries to establish recycling plans and identify recyclers. Recovering recyclables has become a sophisticated process. This waste management plant receives some of Lake County's recyclables and is an example of today's state of the art, right here in Northeast Ohio. Computers and computer components have become the latest recycling items. Private companies work with the county to collect and sort out monitors, PC boards, and power supplies to make sure that they get to the proper recycling venue. Lead and other harmful substances must be disposed of properly and data on hard drives must be completely destroyed. As you can see, we throw away a lot of stuff here in Lake County. Here are some things you can do 
to help the impact on our landfill and on our environment. Don't throw hazardous waste into the trash. Hiding paints, oils, and chemicals in your garbage will have serious consequences for the environment. Wait for the special collections. Take advantage of your community's recycling program. The county website or your city government can give you all of the details. Send metal scrap to a recycler. It can't be buried at the landfill. It has value and shouldn't be discarded. Take your old computer or TV to a recycler like eScrap. They will dispose of it properly. Find a place that will take your yard waste. Check the county website for details. And businesses should take advantage of the efforts of the Business Waste Reduction Committee. See the county website or contact the Ohio State University Extension in Painesville for details. The next time you take that weekly trip to the curb, think about what you're throwing away. You can make a difference in Lake County.